This is a podcast of Nathan, Nat and Sean. Let's go. All right, well, a friend has just walked in. Oh. The one and only Sunrise weatherman, Sam Mack, is in town. And thank you guys for allowing me back in. It's I been know. so long. You haven't been returning my calls. I've been trying to, like, please, can, do you know someone who knows someone to let us back into WA? Yeah. But finally, it's happened. But you were saying to me as soon as you, like, spent five minutes here, you went, oh, this is overrated. Yeah, I feel like we've done it. Yeah, I mean, nothing's really changed. Has it? I mean, you guys are still on breakfast. I know. I know. No. Oh, we love about Don't that worry. Too. Yeah. <laughs> We know. Uh, yeah, we're, uh, like the, me- we're, like, we're like the pinnacles. <laughs> in the meantime, like miracles have happened over east. Like you got a girlfriend, and now you're expecting a oh, baby. That's like on. what the hell is going yeah. on? There? Well, I mean, we know. Oh yeah, what's going, going on. on. I had a busy lockdown. You know, it's it's exciting. <laughs> Congratulations on, on, on impregnating someone. How was that? <laughs> I think it's always been a dream of mine. <laughs> <laughs> it took a while to figure out how exactly to do it. <laughs> oh, there's some great YouTube tutorials. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I'll send you the link. That's what maybe I won't. Yeah. It won't be for me. <laughs> <laughs> I've been trying to send some to Nathan for years. <laughs> <laughs> now, Sam, you've been bloody busy. Uh, we're just saying, obviously, you come over here, which is great news for us and showing off some of our great towns. But yeah. tell us about where you've been around the world. Okay. So Okay. This year. Sure. In the last uh, five or six weeks, we've done Canada, we've done Qatar, we've done four days in Singapore, and now like that was just our warm up. That was the entree. Now we're going to Bustleton. Yeah, oh, yes. that's yes. the main course. Yes, yes. the, the amuse bouche before. <laughs> that's interesting. So I've been to the Galleria. I've been to um, Inalu. You went to Inalu, yeah. I've been to Osborne Park. Oh, mm. have you heard of it? I have. Of course, I have. Yeah, yeah, mm. yeah. yeah. But, you know what though? WA Tourism didn't push that as the number one venue to Osborne go to. Park. Interesting. Yeah. Interesting. That's weird. Do yeah. they know they've got the cinemas there? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Heaps of car I'll, yards. I'll remind them. I'll remind <laughs> them. <laughs> they know they've got the cinemas there. Have you been to the new Karen Up Shopping Centre? No, but I, we were just talking about it with Taryn and she was saying that they've built a whole new ring yeah. around it and it's like Don't. outdoor dining. Al Fresco. Yeah. Yes. Al, Al Fresco. Yeah. Mate, it is flash It's ass. fancy. So you that's what I've been. But also, so when you go the there. Pandemic, yeah. I've been away and now I come back and uh, Karen Up has a yes. ring of steel. Mm. <laughs> There's Al Fresco. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Now, yeah. you've done radio like we have, and um, when they uh, throw out an idea of perhaps something we can do, we sort of have a say in it usually. Yeah. Are you like a war correspondent? Are you just sent to places and you don't get a say? <laughs> do you um, get a say? Oh, well, I wanted to go to Osborne Park. <laughs> <laughs> and they said categorically no. no. Just, but they just chose Margaret from, River. Just down from the cinemas. cinemas. They're yeah. like, oh, Margaret River. So, yeah. you know, uh, look, I do get a little bit of a say, but but on a trip like this, definitely WA Tourism have ideas on like, yes. you know, we've got to show people over east and, you know, yeah. we're going to remind them of all these amazing things you can come and do in WA. So obviously we're happy to be a part of that. So, yes, we do have a say, but not the final say. Can you tell me about the worst morning of weathermanning that you did? For us, one of the worst things that we've <sighs> done was remember and it wasn't the event it was the temperature when we were above that we were oh. at yes, the Aloft Hotel <laughs> great hotel, hotel. Really fantastic great hotel. hotel and we're out on like the terrace area and um and like our, we were told to dress warm and Sean and I just didn't really grasp that concept yep. we were sh- remember we were shivering so much <laughs> Like it's the coldest of ever, ever, I mean, ever been. Ever if been, the weatherman really. can, uh, can't anticipate the cold, then there's something wrong. So with that's there. true. So, yeah. And, and yeah. it was it was actually a painful morning. It hurt the entire morning. So mm. have you experienced something like that? Oh yeah, um, regularly. I mean, look, we we're often in very very cold spots like that, and sometimes I'm so caught up in you know my big social media following that I forget to check so the weather. Many. Sure, <laughs> <laughs> sure. Fifty thousand. Yeah, thank you. Which is a little which shocks a lot of people <laughs> that I forget to check the weather, and so I've had principals from schools come down with jackets for me because they've seen yes. me on TV in the Blue Mountains. They're like, mate, I just felt like you needed a jacket. Here you go. <laughs> I'm standing there in a linen shirt. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so yeah, that happens. Um, one morning, I mean, we do everything and anything in this job, like you guys, you know. But yeah. one morning. Morning, and you give everything a go. One morning we were at a um, a dog grooming facility where two dogs started having sex live <laughs> on the air in the background, but I couldn't see it. So I'm just talking to the camera because I can't see it and yeah, I can hear yeah. Koshi losing it. Like he's laughing. They're all doubled over. I don't know what they're laughing at. And then they go, Sam, turn around. And I turn around and I see Red Rocket and I see... Live all, sex show. Yeah, live sex show. Santa's little helper. So that was confronting. Um, <laughs> I've had many rabbits have sex on top of me. 
Oh, really? Yes, as I lay in a hammock. Okay. We filmed it as well. Yeah. yeah. Is this an OnlyFans? No, this, <laughs> this, wasn't, this wasn't for the show. You can subscribe. <laughs> <laughs> right. Right. Yeah. Yeah. I thought we were just sharing stories. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, we are. Yeah, that's right. Um, we had to do a morning of archery, which, you know, no offence to people who are into archery, but it's just not my thing. Yeah. Mm. And, mm. and I, to try to jazz it up, this is when I just started on Sunrise, I said, well, why don't I put a, a photo of my opposition TV weatherman, Stevie Correct. Jacobs, on the yeah. middle of the... Yes. And then I got in a lot of trouble for mentioning the opposition on oh. air. <laughs> yeah. So it was they my first exist. couple of weeks, they're like, don't mention the opposition, do not mention yeah. Why would you give them a free kick? I'm like, it's not a free kick, I want to hit him with an arrow. <laughs> <laughs> it's not a free kick, they're watching us. That's exactly. And, <laughs> yeah. and where is he now? No, he's a great guy. Yeah, yeah that's right. So yeah, I bought a big issue off How does it... <laughs> How does it work when you're doing the weather from here this time of year? The sun doesn't come up till 7 oh, o'clock here, which yeah. is 9 o'clock on the East Coast. So yeah. essentially you're doing all your weather crosses in the dark. Yeah, that's Saying, right. come and visit this marvellous place. <laughs> and it's, Do you know how hard it is to say to a guest, can you meet us there at 4.30am? Yeah, it's oh, really gig. hard. Um, so the, the short answer is a little bit of TV magic. Right. So oh, we will lies. do the show for the East live yep. and then we'll do specific segments just for WA in the light. So we I do the show twice. No wonder I'm a little bit insane. Oh you, so what's imagine time do you us stay on? imagine them telling us we're doing this show twice. <laughs> no. Oh mate. <laughs> no, <laughs> in no, a million thank you. years. There'd be some hissy fits would be an understatement. Yeah. You would need do a you, lot of rabbits oh. for that show. <laughs> <laughs> do you do you stay on East Coast time and, and you know when you're travelling around how do you work it out? Yeah, I try to stay on East Coast time but then sometimes the kitchens don't open for dinner until certain times. Yeah. Like, so it's, <laughs> it's, it's very right. tricky my life. You wouldn't understand the intricacies involved with getting a good meal. And people would, la- people would laugh if you were trying to tell them how hard things have been. Yes. I've just travelled over. Just Canada. watching you like oh, swan around Qatar yeah. and Canada. Yeah. Oh, I've got to go to Singapore next week. Oh, it sucks. Yeah, very true. So I'm not complaining. Like, I love it. It's, yeah. um, you know, I'm very lucky. Have you finished your renovations or is the house still a building site? Oh, it's it's 85% there. Oh, no We've wonder you got... never go home. Yeah. You don't want to be home for that. Yeah, yeah. You know, I think anyone who's renovated, you get to the end of the project and there's always some disagreements yes. where the builder feels like it's completely and you feel like it's not, but the because still you wants thought the there would price. be a, r- a roof. Yeah. You thought you'd have rails on your stairs, mm. but um, you know, look, am I venting now? Um, no. So we're going to sort that out. <laughs> Do you know any good lawyers? <laughs> Things are going really well, aren't yeah, they? they are. Well, have yeah. such a good time down south. Yeah, love it. Thank like, you, team. It's good to see you again. Valley. Yeah, thank you. We're glad we opened I, the borders again. I appreciate to you. it. Yeah, and I can't believe we used to be rivals, and now I know. look at us sitting. Oh, don't around bring it up. Don't bring it up. Don't give him a free kick. <laughs> <laughs> Stevie Jacobs, we love you. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Sam. Thanks, Sam. Nathan, Matt, and Sean is a Nova podcast. For more great comedy shows like this, head to novapodcasts.com.au.